Hit that button again. That better not be an update downloading. Switch the screen over. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. It is an update. Okay, so clearly, so we'll wait for this. 35 seconds, we can do that. Um, there, with the patch that was out today, uh, apparently some people were complaining that it corrupted their save files. My PlayStation was off, not in rest mode. Are in gamer. It's a new game. It's called Returnal, PlayStation Five exclusive. It is a shooter action roguelike. But you already know this because you have it. Comment bagel, massive raid. Hello everyone, welcome on in. Lovely to see ya. We just switched games, I hope you don't mind. See some Isaac emotes, they're beautiful by the way. Aww. Remind me tomorrow to send me those musics. Hey Jade, would you mind sending me those musics tomorrow? Thanks bud, have a good night, catch you later. Just downloading an update because I didn't have my PlayStation turned on. So you get to see me on... In my glory. Loving this game. Loving this game. It is, uh... It is as, as if... The gods above created a game just for me. And it is... Yeah, it is amazing. You're struggling with the first boss so bad? Um, I'm up to the fifth biome now. No, did we? Yeah, I beat the fourth. I beat the fourth biome. Aaron Gamer, why are you asking me these questions? You have the game. <laughs> you, you know this. <laughs> You do, right? You've been talking about it all week. I could have sworn. Maybe I'm getting you. Yeah, yeah, see? <laughs> I do have Snekos. Yes, if you're interested in seeing my snakes, they're probably sleeping right now. Let me see. Let me see. Let me, let me go find out. I'll be right back. This is Feora. We had a raid. A raid? Comment Bagel came in and somebody wanted to see the snakes, so. Well, you got the snakes. Yeah. <laughs> Albino corn snake. Not even close, no. This is a blue eyed leucistic butter bamboo. 
Oh my god, she's twisting all over the place. Uh, ball python. Yeah. No, that's her natural color. She's not albino. Albine, albinism, I guess, would give her red eyes. She has blue eyes. You're feisty. She, she, you never feed her. That's the problem. She's so starving. Look, she's skin and bone. Oh my god. Hey, baby. <laughs> She is all over the place right now. She's very hungry. Oh. <laughs> yeah, this is my life now. She doesn't like the hairs on my arm. She's like, yeah. Get your headset. Time to go to work. So that's that's Faye. Um, if you head to my wife's Instagram, Ms. Queeb. Uh, That's where we post most of the pictures and stuff. Uh, what was the answer? So, I'll pipe up. I'll be captivity for years. Huh. Okay. So. On average, 30 years, but the oldest one in, cap in captivity is 65. And still lay able to lay eggs, you said? Yes. Hmm. Able to lay them through cryptogenesis. It didn't need a boy to think all day. Right. They weren't gorillas. Are you done with them? Yes, she may go eat now. Oh, wow, you got a real child. <laughs> yeah, we got a real child. All right, let's switch scenes here, huh? God, I'm so shiny today. So, ye oldie returnal, new update. I think it's just a pit, the, the, so there was a, like, sort of a minor-ish update today. Um, but they released a, a secondary patch just for, like, I think it's the corrupt save issue, whatever. Mine worked fine, so it's all good. Hopefully they fix that audio thing. So a little bit of little bit of horror, a little bit of uh, thriller. If you've seen the movie Edge of Tomorrow, it's basically that. Like even some of the enemy designs, very reminiscent of things in the movie. And this is us. We play Celine. Um, and I am on the... How do I explain that? I am on the second... Uh, cycle, I guess? This is actually very, very tough start. Very tough start. <laughs> this is the first room in the game. Holy shit. Come on now. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right, Moran, no problem. We lived, we died, we repeat. It didn't full reset me? No, no, no. It never stops. When you say when you say full reset, what do you mean? 
and and what would have prompted that like the update or starting the game from where i am make the chair emote green i should just make a blank emote because you can't see the chair Back to the first cycle. I think I can select to go back there, but you really want to continue. So this is like, this is kind of like NG plus in a way. The story continues and the cycle continues, but uh, yeah, for us, it's, it's a more advantageous because we can unlock more stuff as we progress. Unreal. So, you'll probably notice the little number down the bottom center. That's your adrenal meter. Uh, that climbs as you get more successive kills without getting hit. Easier said than done, especially in these uh, new zones. And especially since we've only got the starting pistol right now. It's a glyph there. Um, as you level that up, uh, you get various sort of passive stats uh, from uh, increased uh, damage. I think the currency earning is increased on one of them. Um, there's various various passives and they're set, fixated. Each one's exactly the same every time you reach level 5 is the maximum. Uh, one small side effect is you'll start to see as I'm shooting... Those little blue things firing out of the gun. I think you get five at max level of those as well. So what we want to do right now, since I'm at full health, I'm going to pick up... Uh, oh, this is a... Right. So next to the health bar on the bottom left, you'll notice three little pips. If I pick this up, it will fill one. Because we're at full health, if I was to pick up a regular heal, not a resin, but a Silphum, um, it would act the same and we would be able to increase our max health once those three are filled. It might sound a little bit complicated, but it's it's not. It's very, very straightforward, actually. Oh, shit. Close. So you definitely want to avoid damage whenever possible. Some rooms you have to figure out which way is the best way to attack them. Rogue like versus rogue light. There's an excellent video I recommend if you are looking to research that from Game Maker's Toolkit or Mark Brown on YouTube. Uh, just search for roguelike Mark Brown. You'll find it. Now, this is interesting here as well. The blue stuff. See the number 15 on the bottom left? That is our weapon proficiency. Every time we open a chest... Um, the pool of weapons that you draw from is set at a specific level. Or I think you have a, a chance of getting slightly higher, but um, the higher that number, the better the weapons you'll find, which means the better off you'll be. Now, we've still got only the basic item. Bit of a bummer. That's a teleport, much like uh, Gungeon. Malignancy is another thing. So we're going to pick this up. 
Um, hopefully nothing happens, but it'll probably give us a malfunction. So we have to open two containers. Oh, crap. You have to open two containers to get rid of that malfunction. Not being able to pick up weapons is rough because we kind of need one right now. All right. So this should be just a standard heal, I guess. Nope, that's another slot anyway. Anyway, you can see we now have a little bit extra max health. So this one either... Yeah. Do I take this? Okay, so that purple one we picked up for free. That was good. No damage taken. Let's have a quick look here. Alright. Nothing much going on upstairs, huh? Uh, malfunctions, you can carry two of them. If you pick up a third, you lose one of your artifacts. Artifacts are passive upgrades for the run. That's bad. You do not want to lose artifacts. Most of them are pretty good. No fall damage. Unless you have the debuff that does that. Ether is a permanent... Well, it's a it's a persistent uh, currency. You can take that between runs. And you can use it... You'll see me use it in this run. I, I really should be saving them and farming them. But I ain't got time for that. So fingers crossed this doesn't hurt us. Sweet. And that's about it. I think we're done here. Did we go up there? That might be the way forward, huh? Maybe. Nope, that's the way back. Uh, you can fall off the edge. Uh, you suffer a little bit of damage, which obviously has pretty significant implications as well. This room's safe. Open containers too. All right, here's the first one. All right. So we can't pick this up, obviously. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing. I don't really like the, the rocket launchers in there. You need to be at medium to long range for those to be effective. Short range sucks. You squish all the little plants and stuff around. Sometimes they contain money or items. I like, I'll take the rocket launcher if we have no other alternative, but yeah. Uh, there's an active reload system. You probably saw me doing that a couple of times. So shoot, shoot, and then... Oh, I missed that one. Some of the attack patterns of the enemies is just stunning. Awesome to look at. Uh, the money on the ground, that's the little yellow orbs. They disappear very quickly. So you've got to run in and get them. Which, again, has its own risks associated. Dashing uh, will allow you to pass through most things, but you've got to be real careful. Some things, I think purple shots, you can't dodge through. This sucks. Like that would be nearly impossible to dodge. We got lucky there.
Something protected us. Oh, because when you get to when you get to level five adrenaline, you get a shield for free. We get one hit protection, which is almost gone. Is that it? Nope. There's something right on my butt. Damn it. So things with red shields, you have to attack with melee first. Then you can do shooty shoot after that. Proficiency level 16. Nice. Oh. They're evil. You want to see the organ fight again? That was so good. So good. What an epic fight that was. Oh, that didn't even heal me to full. Damn. Hmm. What do we have here? Oh. That's nice. So this is an item blueprint, essentially. You take that to a special machine, um, but there's only a couple of machines in the game. Um, yeah, we'll have to figure that out. It's most likely near or after the boss. Now I'm at max health. There's a second container, probably give us another malfunction. They took away ship heels. Sons of... Mm, okay. Hardened sidearm. I'll take it. So, protection is now reduced by 20%, but we can pick up weapons. That's a decent sidearm, actually. They took away the ship heels. Of course they did. Tracker swarm is dope. Snubnose Barrel, 93% learnt. Deals more damage at the cost of accuracy. Okay. We we shall see. They must have, must have watched the stream. Hey, just because I backtracked like 30 times to get full heals and then gain a ridiculous amount of health before the end of the first biome. Not my fault. Game was made that way. Built different. Well, there's our snub nose. Hopefully it's not too bad in terms of... Uh... It's accuracy. That is an artifact. Overload rush. Successful overloads briefly increase speed and protection by 15%. So... The money that we're collecting, we're going to be using that. I won't, I won't buy that though. That's, that doesn't sound very good to me. What I would like to do is get to that. Sick. And. Give me the cash. Overload disabled. Oh man, use keys. We don't have any keys. All right, we got a heal that we can take with us now. So now I can't take this because the risk is too great. Although, hang on, hang on a second here. Incorrect behavior when resting in Helios. Brutal, bro, brutal. We have no artifacts. We can't lose anything here. Resin destroyed. Hmm. 
do you mean resin destroyed? Oh, that was the penalty, the resin destroyed. So it took away one of my... Okay, so we just wasted that one then. It doesn't say what the behavior was. Oh, okay, so they might not have taken it away. All right, the next time we take damage, we will test. We will go back. This is a must know for all involved. This here is a cipher. Oh, shoot. I think I left one of them behind. Oh, well, no big deal. It's a language cipher. It lets you uh, uncover more of the lore. Uh, beams of light. Bad. But you knew that. Hey, base. How you doing? Now it's less than before, but still repeatable? I mean, either way. You can just walk through the red stuff. Not the beams. Not the beams. The red stuff on the ground, yes. Out. That was like a secret room. Actually, let's test, huh? Let's test, see if I can... Yeah. Feels good, because it is good. Uh, ether is your permanent upgrade resource, as I was talking about before. It's a uh, it's a it's a meta currency that stays with you. Oh, I did a bad. This is a parasite. So you attach parasites to you, right? So collecting oblites repairs integrity, inhibits the use of silphum resources. Has anyone used this before? Do they know if it's... If I can still increase my maximum? It says still from resources, right? Like... Yeah, I don't think that's worth... I don't know, maybe. Maybe not. No change to max. It did give us the bar? Yeah, that's weird. I don't know what that meant then. Resin destroyed. Uh, that smells like a combat room. Um, don't really want to go in there just yet. I'm going to head back. We're going to try out the ship thing. We'll see what happened. We'll see if it's repeatable, if it's less, if it's more. What ifs. Max goes up at three bars, correct. How did we get back there? Put that away? That away. All right. Let's find out. It only heals once. Ah. Did they make it a full heal though? Hey, Batoto. How you doing, man? I'm 
Like, why wouldn't you shower first or something? Well, she's in a spacesuit, I guess. Okay, let's double check. Well, no, out here, obviously, the giant hole would prevent removing the spacesuit, but surely this would be pressurized? I mean, that's the reason there's two... Never mind. Wait, has she got cobwebs inside? Girl, come on. You don't think my game is updated? Literally just did. Literally. Yeah. Yeah, how you can sleep in this room is... Uh, mm -mm, nope. Mind you, spiders are probably the last of her worries. Because you just beat the game? What do you mean? Yeah, still full heals. Sick. Everything's working. Right, so I updated at midday today. And I played it after the update. Everything was fine. Um... And then there was another patch, which just came through, or at least I saw it. Uh, when I turned the PS5 on. And um, it updated again. So you might be correct. Auto repairs while at low integrity suffer damage when picking up items. Hmm. Also not worth. Not until we got a big a bit of health. But auto repairs at low integrity is kind of sick. Alright, so let's see. I've got two malfunctions at the moment. High probability of picking up a third. He destroyed. Okay. Okay. Yeah, the ship heal worked. Yeah. As it as it same as it did yesterday. Right. So that's a problem. Yeah, keys are really rare in this, so hang on to them. Now I get it. It's not just artifacts that are destroyed, it's like literally any of your consumables by the looks of it. Uh, that's the door that... yeah. No, that's where we just came from. What the hell? I get so lost in this game. Here's this. So what we're gonna do... A bit of sneaky sneak. Pick this up. We're not going to risk getting a third one. That's obviously bad. Has to be a combat room. No? Oh. Okay. So that's an area we can't get to yet. It is in water. Obviously, since Celine doesn't even shower, she's allergic to it. Pretend that didn't happen. Here's a side room with more water in it. Oh, this is great. It's not supposed to be underwater? What, all the stuff down there? 
Oh, hold on. Is it on platforms? Oh, okay. Hang on. No. No, you lie. Still not a full heal, damn it. Oops. Sorry, Slink. Sorry. My bad. I did that. So it's cool. Alright, we've got a key back. I didn't even realize we picked up a key before. Still not at full health. Oh my god, Celine. You're a mess. Nah, nah, this is just gonna be a regular run. So. What uh, Steineken is referring to, last night we did something pretty different. Um, every time I took even a little bit of damage, I would leave and come back and leave all of the heals until the very end of the biome and leave all of the chests until I had gotten the most uh, efficiency or whatever it's called, weapon efficiency. I could. That gives us a better chance at higher tier weapons and a lot, a lot of extra health. Uh, very time consuming. What was it? Like two and a half, three hours just for the first biome though? It's a bit rough. So this, this little... I'm trying to look around for a specific button. There it is. That opens this little stash right... Jesus Christ, that scared the shit out of me. This little stash right here. We got a rot gland lobber. I do not like that weapon either. Wow, we're just going pistols all night. So you notice on the map down the bottom left, visible here as well, the blue doors are like side areas so it's best to clear them first before you move through the cyan square doors imho dash disabled it's disappointing bro we can do this we can go in here now all right i'm gonna leave that heal so I wasn't able to do this yesterday because I didn't have the power. Now I got the power. What you got? Fabrication cost reduced by 15%. Suffer damage when picking up items again? Come on! You suck. Good to know that's there though. If you were min-maxing... That'd be kind of a good one to pick up last. The Varia suit. Oh yeah, the the similarities between this game and Metroid are pretty strong.
There's another item down there. What is that? Ah, okay. We cannot get through there yet. We need a passive upgrade that increases the damage of our sword. Using a consumable briefly increases protection by 15%. 250 bucks? Get the hell out of here with that. You are kidding me right now. I'll just take my free stuff from the from the plants and go. The gravity suit? I have a feeling there's something like that coming. Because there's a few areas we still can't access and it seems the only way to get there is to jump really, really far. Uh, this is my house. Don't worry about it. Personal thing. This is a... Uh, like an antechamber. It's just dropped down here, I think. Yeah, we've seen... Seen these rooms before. Shop. We got a shop. Alright, how much money have I got? 313. This is a little online thing. I can trade five of my um, ether, the stuff we've been collecting, the, the very rare stuff that carries over between runs, for 200 bucks. Or I can trade 300 bucks for five ether. ether. Um, and that resource is shared with the online community. So a little bit of give, a little bit of take, a little bit for you, a little bit for me, you know. There's our weapon upgrade. Uh, yeah, let's see what's what. Blade balancer, melee attack. Low integrity gain, 25% proficiency rate. Gaining or fixing malfunctions repairs integrity. That's all pretty good, but I'm going to take this. Oh, you saw a, sti a, a cipher? And we want to pick this up as well at some point. It's an extra 25 health. 25% health. Integrity is health, by the way. Suit integrity. Oh, this thing? Yeah, that's the, the tablet. Memories of family are severed. Leprosy of the mind that sees an astronaut life, but on maybes? Constantly on the verge of preaching Helios. Reaching? Reaching Helios. Watching me enter the house before... Descent to Underworld? Question mark. Right, obviously we need more of a uh, translation there. That's the boss up there um, for this zone. Wait, is the boss the organ guy? It is. We can see him again. It may in the run, but we can see him. It's gorgeous. Awesome fight. A tiny room. Ah, oh, come on. Snub nose with piercing. Bonus damage, fire rate. Shield breaker. I'll take it. I'll take it. I don't mind. I don't think the level of the weapon, aka the number that's next to it, really has that big of an impact. I could be wrong. Increase our health here. I probably could have kept that for later. Should have. Ah, 
Uh, by the way, be very careful when sleeping in those beds because enemies can spawn afterwards. Just a little uh, FYI. In fact, there's a clip for you. I made it into a command. You goddamn right I did. My most epic gaming achievement ever. Four and a half hour, no, almost four hour run. Just threw it away. Didn't want it. Still not sure. Oh, good. I was about to say, I'm still not sure what this room is for. Usually there's not a no enemies in here. And it's all about that little orb in the center of the room, which I have no idea what it does. Oblite Siphon. I can shoot the thing. But it comes back. There we go. That's a weapon. Leech rounds, rising piss, rising pitch, and armor piercing. So that red thing over there is uh, bad. It's a big bad that's forming. You've got a, a couple of seconds before it happens. This weapon is dope. Oh, yeah. Oh, he gets a shield when he gets knocked down. Interesting. Oh, I like this a lot. Electro pylon driver. This is kind of a weird weapon. You can shoot different points and it will form like little little lines, little lasers. I don't like it. We clear? We are clear. Two-way radio. Still don't know what the two-way radio does. Kill enemies with pentagrams? I ain't taking the time to line that shit up. 
No, thank you. So here... We have a challenge room. Which we can attempt. There's a locked door over here. I just used my last key. To pick up the two-way radio. So we need another key to get in there. Ether's good though. Ether we, we like. The more ether we have, the more flexible we are as we get further into the game. Should we do the challenge room? I think we give it a shot. Two protection for every ether in your inventory. Oh. Nice. So this will probably be the end of us. It's a very dangerous area. No retreats. The door locks down. You just have to fight whatever the hell's in here. And there's like two or three waves of enemies coming in. Alright, we gotta get over there. Take him out. Like that. What the hell is that thing? I'm getting out of here. Ah! Right on. Oh, you're lucky. Sucks I got hit, though. Ah, that wasn't even the end. I like this gun, dude. I like it. Rising pitch seems really, really good. He is pissed. Shit. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Help. Heal. And I'm dead. He hit me. Wow. Run over. What time is it? Two o'clock. All right. One more. Follow the music. Oh, we got a little story interlude. Oh, no, no. Follow the music is the first boss. I, th I think. The world rearranging. We woke him up. He was sleeping. Fair. I'd be pissed too. I'll be back. Actually, was that a... I think that was a parasite, actually. Aether. Even better. Grants 20% stagger power for each attacked parasite. That is, uh... 
top level. That's really good. How much was it? 150? Cheap. So that'll take us down. There's an item there. I think we just go up, yeah? Or or down rather. Yeah, might be time. Oh, come on. <sighs> Screw this. got 104 we need what 150 for that other artifact looks like we left a heal behind oh it was the purple thing Explosive spit slug shot critical stagger. That is the shotgun, right? Pretty sure it is. Seems all right. Slower. These things are pretty easy to deal with. Pretty good. Malignant chest there. Bit of cash. Hollow Seeker. Shrapnel 2 retarget split stream. That's that's my baby right there. Alright, we want to go down a level.
more ether? Yeah, I'll just keep collecting ether if it's e even if it's just to collect a few before we die. I'm happy with that. Proficiency gain disabled. Lose obelites when suffering damage. Both of those, pretty rough. Uh, like darkness crystals in Hades. Kind of. You don't... It, the stuff that you buy with them isn't... I don't think it's permanent. It's, it's stuff you use on, on a run. So they're very useful, but it's... Like, you're better off saving them until you actually do need them. So this is a chest down... Where? In here somewhere. Under? But how? Is there a hole in the tree? Must be. No. Some other way down. Repairs in integrity by 5% of damage dealt per adrenaline level. Oh, we want that. Oh, we want that. Just need 300 bucks. Ah, there we go. Can't do it. Can't collect either of those things. Ah! Celine, ladies and gentlemen. That's an artifact? Yeah, we can't afford it. And I'm not going to open the chest. We'll lose something that we're carrying. Potentially. On the ground next to the chest? What? Wait, no, it was proficiency, wasn't it? Yeah, we can't can't pick it up. Which way was it going? Celine is not long for this world. Greatly increases max integrity. Upcoming malfunctions have harder fix requirements. I'll take that. something flying around here. Hello. I love this gun so much.
So we've got a locked side panel, side path. Let's see what's up here. Key. All right, we'll go through the locked blue door. Hopefully it's friendly. That there is a malfunctioning, uh, what do they call it? A uh, fabricator, malfunctioning one. So you get a random item that increases in price as you continue to generate them. The first one's 75, but we need cash. We need 300. No baddies this time? Are we the baddies? Oh my. That's a something. Leech rounds two at 40%. If I can survive. That was two killed at 40%. What are we at now? 44, so 2% per kill. It probably depends on the enemy too, maybe? I don't know. We're leaving so much weapon proficiency behind. It's really sad. Need a key for that as well. I haven't had much luck with the red keyed chests. They always seem pretty lame. Like it's usually just consumables and stuff. Nothing, nothing extra fun. Son of a bee. Not cool, bro. All right, I guess that's a dead end for now. Maxing out leech rounds too will mean that every weapon we find with that attribute will be usable immediately. Broken fabricator, teleport. No, we gotta go back. Damn. Oh, we were heading in the right way. Looks like there's a door up high in the last room we were in. Secret room. Ah. 
So these secret rooms, you just run around, collect all the breakable stuff. Uh, this one should have a couple of parasites or other upgrades in it. Somebody speculated yesterday that you should possibly shoot these instead of running through them. But I mean, we just dropped four items there, so that's not too bad. Doubles obelite collection radius. And dropped obelites disappear one second faster. Survivor killing blow detaches afterwards. Triggers two malfunctions on detach. Alright, we're going to take both of these. Because we're about to buy something that will increase upgrade or inflict damage. All right. Thank God. That worked. Now, where was that? That artifact. It ain't that. Was that the fabricator? I can't remember what the room looked like. At the very beginning? Hmm. Maybe. Maybe. I like this weapon a lot. Once we unlock uh, leech rounds too, we should be fine in terms of health. Not through there. There it is. That's where it is. Repairs integrity by 5% of damage dealt per adrenaline level. And that should stack with our leech rounds. Should. There's a similar one as well that... Oh, no, it's it's a... Uh, triggers a stagger. We actually saw it on the last... Um, the last go-round. Proficiency gain disabled. Yeah. A consumable. I've never had trouble finding consumables until now. So we'll have to backtrack once again, I think. Gonna be unkillable? Mm. It's a very difficult game. <laughs> so we currently have uh, three parasites. You can see them on me right now. Figured that might be the case. It's our friend. Oh, come on. Who's shit in your cereal?
Where'd he go? Can't dodge through those. <sighs> Shrapnel to retarget to. Oh. No, we're going to stick with leech rounds. Enemy scale with time? No. Thank God. <laughs> no. There's a set number of rooms. Um, you can choose to clear them or not. Uh, well, some of them have to be cleared completely, but others you can just bypass. Give me something I can use, please. Had no weapon proficiency for this entire time. Uh-oh. Lasers and I don't uh, exactly get along very well. The timer is actually really good, especially if you like editing. Because um, you can see which runs belong to what. Key. Oh man, we are in a rough way here. Consumable? Where? I think you're right. Oh my god. Okay. Damage siphon is activated. Okay, we have a key, so we can go to the red chest. We can pick up the blue stuff. Actually, there was a locked room, wasn't there? Chest or room, chat? Either could be BS, so it doesn't really matter. room. Mm, where was that? Wait. Yeah. Oh, that's right. It was at the end of... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Parasite. Auto repairs while at low integrity. Dropped obelites disappear one second faster. That, that I can do. You have similar already. You can't have two with the same debuff? Oh. So we use the machine and take it? No, that would be bad. Oh. It's really powerful though. 
see if we get lucky. This is remove all. A random parasite produces all the lights in return. That was the one. That gave us two malfunctions. That was the one I didn't want removed. Maybe get rid of this one now, please. Fifty-fifty. It's me. It'll be not the one we wanted. Hilarious. Hilarious. Well, we are parasite free now. Hooray. It's worth it. Trust me. Auto repair at low. Um, it's one of the best upgrades in the game. Literally kept me alive during the boss fight. Several boss fights we had. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's that's pretty. That's fair enough. We got to kill thirty enemies. Mm. Open containers at full integrity, minus fifty percent weapon damage. Okay. Well, not great. We might get lucky and find an item that lets us remove them for free. That would be ideal. Can you spend your oblite somewhere? We don't have a shop on the map yet. No, not yet. Is my house still closed? House still closed. Hey, Kragon. Very, very good game. Here's a shop. Somewhere. There we go. All right. That's an extra life. Take that. Protection. Possibly help, huh? 300. We're going to have to come back. We could... Oh, we're 8 shy. I could withdraw. Spend 5 ether and withdraw. Come on, just give me 8 bucks. Somewhere. Two bucks. Where's damage siphon coming from? That is impressive. We haven't even unlocked it on the weapon yet. Unless it's got level 1 already. That's ridiculous. The item we used. Oh, that was it. That is dope. Problem is, once we, once we reach um, max integrity here.
All right, let's withdraw some money. Buy the protection as well. Uh, where is it? Where's the thing? Out here? There it is. Good, not good enough. Yeah, that's fine. I don't, I don't mind. The secondary is is nowhere near as important as the damage we're doing. Ah, uh, we do need to remove these, huh? Open containers three. Kill hostiles another twenty six. Jesus. Why do we use guns? So we don't have to use the sword. Sword's good for some things. Did you see something up top there as well? Can I get up there? No, we go under to get up? Question mark. Ah, there we go. Now we can go back to the purple chest here. That's cash in the form of malignant cash. We could maybe pick it up, but sometimes it's not worth taking the risk. Anything else here? No, that's it, huh? Okay. Should have gotten one more. Can't. Three is a critical. You lose. What was that chest? Is it that one? Yeah, 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 yeah. Kills three, suffer damage when using keys. Not too bad. All right, next room. We'll go to the blue door first.
Oh, suffer damage to get an item. Let's do it. Yeah, five parasites max. Uh, I was unaware of the fact that you can't double up on negative effects. Bit of a bummer. Oh, baby. Shame I've only got one parasite attached. Would have had a few more. It's okay. Ain't mad. Hostiles counter on hit. Oh, crap. That ain't good. That ain't good at all. Celine. You off, airgun? I'm not far behind, honestly. Oh, that ain't good. Damn it. Oh, that ain't good, man. <sighs> Suit powers are keeping us breathing right now. Portal beam. Shrapnel and retarget. Hmm. Yeah, I gotta I gotta keep leech. Got her. Level five adrenaline max. Do it. Let's wait on that. Two what at the same time? Oh, kill hostiles simultaneously. Need to use a sword for that or a big explosion. Maybe that. Yeah, that's a tough one. Well, we did pick up something that makes that harder. That might have been the last run. I can't remember. Yeah. Where to go, though? Yeah, it's going to be a tough one. We'll get it.
All right, challenge room, cyan door. Give for free. Give for free. Have we unlocked the, the leech rounds? We did. So that's active now too. We'll see just how effective it is. These things here are like, uh, what'd you call them? Little loot goblins, I guess. Kill them, you get cash. How dare he just appear out of nowhere like that, though. Two-way radio. What did you say that did? Oh, the more ether you have, something. Okay. So we get an extra 12% protection, yeah? So gross. Sounds big, whatever it is. Hey, my name's McQueeb. Celine. How did you end up in this mess? And that's how I met Celine. Just a different one? Are you tougher? Oh, we did the two for one? Oh, that was lucky. Leech doesn't seem to be much. Uh, it may not seem like it, but... Um yeah, no, it's any, anything is good. And we have a heal when we reach low as well, so... We should be at least somewhat protected. Especially since I'm just taking all the damage today, apparently. Two in a really short time? Yeah, probably. Allows a consumable to be reused. Detaches after first use. Triggers a critical malfunction on detach. I mean, I do need to collect a parasite, but... No. No, let's not do that.
Ah, that's underwater, okay. What does retaliation do when we trigger retaliation on attack? Ah, the red ball, uh, the red orbs there, I get it. That's what's that's what's hurting us so much. It's the retaliation. I leave something in here. The hell? It's a consumed by life. I left behind. I think. Well, it's gone now. All right. Straight across. I need the two keys, don't I? To get to the boss, or is the boss available now? An extra 10% would be very nice. Challenge room? Ah, oh, no. Alright, heading back. Come on. I think that's it in here, right? There's only three. Pretty sure.
I'm collecting a lot more ether. I didn't... I don't remember seeing that much yesterday. It's probably not worth it. Stop doing that. Yeah, every time. I haven't even hitting it there. Collecting monies. God damn. What you got? Projectile portal. Creates a portal in the air that shoots projectiles at hostiles. Sounds good. Oh boy. This guy's got new tricks, huh? That leech, though. Shell 2. Hmm. Here's a test. Let's see if this still has blast shell on it. It does. Okay. So when 2 is yet to be unlocked, you still have access to the first rank. Hey, Sleepwalker. Yes, it is a PlayStation exclusive. Correct. Free? Not free. Repair efficiency, though. That... Do you think that works with Leech? I think it does. 
You say nah? Mm, okay. Come on, just a just a single parasite's all we want. I don't care what it is. So we don't need a key for the boss. We might as well just go to the boss. But I need to get rid of this garbage first. Alright, let's teleport back to the start. See if we can find any other parasite or something. I ain't removing any. I'm not going to remove my parasites. Resident Evil Village it drops tonight. I don't want to take that other one we saw. Criti that was the critical malfunction. If we use an item, right? You can use an item twice, but you get... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not worth. Let's have a look around here. a chest. Did we check that out? We couldn't take that chest earlier. Uh, how did we get down there? It's fine. Whatever. That creepy music again. Seem to be anything left here either. Ah oh, man. Fabricator, we don't even have 75 bucks. Hmm. What was the one in the law room? Was that the one? Because there was one we left behind. Got one key. It's driving you crazy at the same time? Is it giving you troubles? We can get the fabricator. Ah, it's a gamble. I mean, nothing to lose though, right? Gamble's my middle name after all.
Always gamba. Yeah. One, one of your finest parasites, please. Oh, that's fine too. Sure, thanks. Damage siphon for boss. I do not want the boss having retaliation. That would be very bad. Where am I going? Take the bad parasite and deal with it later. <sighs> we could lose some really cool shit. And this game has a habit of taking your best stuff before you're ready. The challenge room is still there. Challenge room might... Mm, that's going to be tough too. I think you suffer even if that's removed, the malfunction, right? No, no, no. It's, it's the parasite that does it, which we would have to remove. Oh, man. Only when you double use an item. All right, where was it? There might, there might have been some we haven't found yet. Let me look around a bit. I hear squishies. Yeah, I can't remember where it is either. This might be it. Oh no, that's all that shit's in the under the water. We can walk through the red stuff. Oh, because there's something underneath. There is something underneath. Right. It's just an ether. something up the very top here. What is that? Nope. Nope. It ain't what I need. God, talk about getting unlucky, huh? Where's the law room? That's back here. Yes. 
Let's go there. I could be wrong, but there's usually one in there. Challenge room and the room before the boss. So the challenge room would be even harder than the boss. But the boss is ridiculous already. It's awesome. Awesome boss. Now let's just run through. See what we can see. We don't have weapon upgrade. Favorite boss so far? They're all really good. The second and fourth, I think, would be the two that take it. Pause button. Get out. We do have a couple of... Something in here. No. Down here, is that in water? Yeah, that's in water, okay. Okay. Um, next room. this the place? I think it is. Just gotta risk it. Gotta risk it. Artifact obelit. What? Hang on. It automatically did it? What did I lose? Still got that. Still got that. Oh well. The last artifact we found? Okay. Okay. That's all right. That's fine. All right, let's go. Let's go whoop this boss. Well, try to. I think we had a lot more health last time. Yeah, I'm glad it doesn't give you two random ones as well as a critical. Like, it just hits you with the critical and that's it.
two turrets shielded on opposite sides. Thanks, guys. Thanks. This is rough. Um, Who's shining that one? Are you? I'm in a bad spot here. Okay. The music is calling me upwards. Melody. Chest? Mm -mm. Not worth taking another malfunction. Could be worse than the other one that we had. We didn't pick up a if what she says thingy, that, did we? If no. What I say is true. That could be my way out of the cycle. No, this fight's good. You you can't dislike this fight. The the music, the it's just yeah, you'll see. You'll see. Ah, oh, but I got snow keys. Let's do it. Did you learn this melody from me? Or did I learn it from you?
almost don't want to kill the guy. Hard one to dodge that one. Hey, buddy. I actually quite like his music.
He just wanted to play some tunes, man. Lightning with Leech was good. Alright, we'll remember that. Increases the positive effects of parasites. Well, I don't mind that at all. Yeah, that's cool. Cool as shit. Do we come back down here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we don't... You just get an item from him. Okay, got it. Got it, got it. How far into the run? Um, this is the first, well, sorry, the fourth biome, but it's the second cycle, so you start over. The landscape is different. a bit? Okay, fine. So the, there's three biomes, essentially. This is the same as the first one, except it's like 60 years later or some shit. Um, so everything's lush and, you know, less run down. And, I mean, it's still very run down, but you know what I mean. That music, amazing. Low health, I don't think it's gonna matter. I think we can keep ourselves topped up anyway. Yeah, yeah, so you cap out weapon proficiency at 15 on the first run. Uh, we can get this up to 30, and then after that I don't know what happens. Do it. Oh, it's the big one. Damn. I hate that guy. Oh, that ain't good. You gotta go.
Oh, that did not. Mm -mm. Celine, get up. Oh, that was a good shot. Messy. We got there. Look at that damage on that weapon. Still not as good. I just have trouble keeping my distance with that guy. That's all. You get these rooms afterwards, so it's kind of like one of each kind of thing. Good stuff. Draw another. Mm, I, I could. I could withdraw another 200 bucks. Anything in the red stuff. I didn't see anything when we were down there before. We'll check it out. Nah. Alright, so let's go back and get some cash. Because I want an extra 10% weapon damage. That would be kind of good. Alright, Batoto. Have a great night, dude. Ah, uh, do we have to run all the way back? Where's the shop gone? Ah, it's just there. Behind and that way. No, that's literally where I just came from. got 23 ether all of a sudden. I don't know how. Return upon completion. Oh, you can only do it once. Huh. Oh, well. Okay. Next zone then, which is where? Over there. All right. What's the objective? Um, well, surviving uh, long enough to uh, find out what's going on. So Celine is uncovering her story and she keeps waking up in the same spot. And she doesn't understand why. wondering about the house that's a whole nother thing oh the front okay this is hard as shit there's enemies here that are for lack of a better word ridiculous they're called drones they shoot rockets very very quickly 
and uh, if they don't like you, they'll charge at you and self-destruct. So that's cool too. can't withdraw. Let's have a look what we got here. Blade Enhancer. At low integrity gain 25% proficiency rate? Eh. At low integrity suit auto repairs itself and that stacks with the other shit we got going on. So, was it 400? 400. Door number one. Let's go. Oh yeah, those drones I was talking about? That's them. They're tough as shit. I hate them. They can't operate doors though. What's this? Proficiency rate by 15. Ooh. Also very good. Alright, we got some good stuff. We need about 600 bucks then. You have seen Edge of Tomorrow? Yeah. Excellent movie actually. Very good. A challenge room? It's one way to go, I guess. Let's do it. everything about this they're so freaking tough now Enough with the ooby doob, scooby doob, banooby purple shit. You just appeared behind me. Fair and balanced.
Oh, you prick. dead. Oh, come on. Three hits was all it was going to take. Show ain't over. Something's still there. Hey, Maxer, how you doing? Easy game. Oh, get the hell out of here. Oh, him too. Mm hmm. Why did I choose to do this room first again? I can't remember. I'm sure, it's a good excuse. All right, we have to be constantly moving between planes. I think, otherwise, we're not going to get anywhere here. Get up. Celine, get up. Help, help. <laughs> this is some bullshit. <laughs> comment <laughs> I thought we were done at two waves yeah and you start over that's it that 
is it. Cut and dry. Uh, let us stop in on my good Australian friend, unholy, lovely young lady. And I'm going to go to bed after I have a sandwich. I'm really freaking hungry. Uh, folks, thank you very much. Had a lovely day again, as always. See that fifth boss someday? Oh, we will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got this. I think I would imagine that... Uh, oh, Aragon, I, I got it, dude. This, yeah. It's a good strategy for 1v1, but we were 4v1 then. And they all had teleporting attacks. It was messy. It's all good. We'll get there eventually. Folks, take it easy. I'm going to eat my sandwich, and I'll catch you later. Bye-bye.